different from the droidic designs. Just had something. <gasps> There's a cove in the area. I am not familiar with any cove. However, old Sedgwick who maintains the lighthouse is as old as the sea itself. If anyone knows this area, it'd be him. Very interesting.
We can tell you're not one of them teeving for something, no. So, who be you? I'm a friend of Jeremiah Covenant. Jeremiah, eh? Is he still alive? Last I saw him months ago, the face of death was on him. He's better in. One had never know my how deserted the Covenant grounds have been. Only what I see prowling round a Trasanti scum. How do they get on the grounds? I hope them to. The only reason I'm still alive is because those thugs need me to mend a lighthouse. This is a treacherous inlet with all the fog, you know. And since the bridge back to the mainland's been destroyed, the Trasanti need me to keep their boats from crashing up on the cliffs. Call me Sedgwick. Are you alone here? No, I am. Them thieves killed me only son Connor when he tried to drive them off. I'm sorry to hear about your loss. Do you have any idea where these thieves are hiding out? Judging by the fair amount of Trasanti patrols I've seen by the caves upon the coast of it, I'd see their hideouts nearby. Sounds dangerous, but I've got no choice. Things will only get worse if they're not stopped. I bet Ambrose is there too. Maybe if I can get to him, the Trasanti won't have any reason to be here. Ambrose, eh? Come to think of it, I may have seen him lurking about. But that's not good news for Jeremiah, I say. As I recall, there was these tunnels that went from the shore up into them cliffs. Right up to this old garrison perched on top. My father kept me from playing up there by sealing off the tunnels with an iron door he kept locked. I wonder if the key might be in his old sea chest. Where is this chest? In me living quarters. Is that a working gun you have there? Maybe. Why do you ask? Those Trisanti robbed me of everything, including my revolver. They didn't find me grandfather's stuff, though, including some silver bullets he got in the Merchant Marines. He believed them superstitions and say you can kill werewolves and evil creatures with them. Considering some of the weirdness going on here, those bullets might come in handy. I know they're in the chest, so yeah. Take this key to my living quarters and have a look-see. Thanks. I appreciate your help. The more of them bastards you kill, the better. The way they killed my son, oh, it's the least I can do.
Jammed. Oh good, you've returned. Jeremiah has been asking for you. He is waiting in the Great Hall. Jammed. Won't budge.
Stuck. Stuck. <laughs> Jeremiah, it's good to see you up and about. Indeed, it feels like I've slept forever. <laughs> I'm still quite weak, though. Um, come. Sit close and tell me what trouble my siblings have caused lately. Ah, yes. Brother. What madness has your family caused this time? Let's remember who started this whole thing, Jeremiah. A pity you're so weak you can't finish it. Why do you bring an outsider into family matters? Afraid you can't stop what you initiated? You, give me the stone around your neck, or I'll kill your dear friend right here and now. No, Patrick, don't do it! I must, Jeremiah. I owe you my life. Ambrose, the only way you'll get this stone is by letting Jeremiah go. You're in no position to bargain with me, outsider. Give me the stone, or my brother here gets a trip to the family mausoleum. Fine. Here's the stone. Now let him go. He's not part of this fight. Here's where you're wrong. You're a stranger to a fight that's over two decades old. Jeremiah has everything to do with this. No! You had that coming for a long time, big brother. Now, fool, you'll taste the power of a real king. <laughs>